Zoom in space, yes. Mari Aravot. All right, how are you guys? Good morning, day two here in Yerevan. Let's go. Let's start the morning by getting Armenian coffee in the van. Thank you so much. All right, love, where's the plan? Uh, we are on the way to Garni. Garni Temple and also Gerard. It's all on the same way. We are so excited. We're going to click amazing pictures and make nice b rolls. Uh, they said it's going to take just 40 minutes from Yerevan. Stop on the way to Garni, but look at the view! Wow, it's just maybe 10 minutes from Yerevan, and we're supposed to see the Mount Ararat, but today it's a little bit cloudy. Doesn't matter, still, the view is nice. so hot today good weather right now this is our first stop I'm in front of Garni temple but before that guys check check out behind me okay I'm just speechless it's so nice here guys right in front of me right in front of me is the Garni temple all right on a rocky 300 meter high of Azad river are the ruins of the impregnable fortress of Garni one of the most ancient monuments of Armenian architecture the scientists believe that the Garni Temple was built in the first century and it was dedicated to the God of Sun. But in 1679, Armenia was hit by a massive earthquake and the temple was destroyed. In 1976, the temple was restored and today the Temple of the Sun God has its original shape with separate missing elements replaced with the modern ones. planning to visit Garni Temple here in Armenia it's 1,500 if you're a tourist and if you're a local FYI it's 500 drum okay guys it's also located in the cliff and surrounded by mountains and one of the most amazing views you'll ever see in your life so I dare you to visit this place okay I'm tasting okay this is a homemade pomegranate wine Okay, let's try it in hot weather. Sweet. Oh, oh, it's good. At least in my mind. Uh huh. Because we are from Malaysia. We are good at Kitai. Too short, my mind. Kitai. All right. This is gonna be our car for the next trip. We are going down somewhere near the river to eat, 
and we have the old school USSR car which is Lada here you go and they're preparing everything it's nice right. So they bring us next to the river and we're gonna eat here in this area. It's a beautiful spot here. We have this small lake there, a small pond where they grew the fish. So we'll eat seafood today. But check this out guys. And they made homemade bread. Get stuck there to cook. Next time I will show you something. Look at the size of this fish. Oh, okay, that's our fish. All right. Oh, that's big. It's gonna be fat. So how they, you like it, how they catch the fish? <laughs> Sorry man, we're just hungry. Hello. And that's our food. He's Arman by the way. He bring us down here. Okay. So this is fresh holy basil. Yeah. So you're gonna roll it like that? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. So how is how is the taste? First of all, the bread is freshly made. They just bring it to us. And then the cheese is a little bit salty. But it really goes, it goes so much with this holy basil, the fresh holy basil and fresh coriander here. It tastes so good guys. And we have here the salad. Look at the color of this tomato. It's so red and the taste is so fruity. Mm. Yeah, grilled bread. Okay, so we have a grilled bread here. So we have to put it here in the soup so it sucks all the flavor all the juice and it looks so good wow check it out oh yes got the tail part no, chili chili oh look at this chili man <laughs> it's bigger than my fish and the bread wow Alive five minutes ago. I'm so sorry, but it's it's so good. <laughs> okay, right now we have a second dish. Check this out. Check the size of it. Oh, sashik! It's a barbecue trout, right? Wow. It doesn't have, uh, have bones. It doesn't have bones inside. Oh. Let me try. 
try this first without the rice. Oh. It's so good. They salted it very nicely. It's just so fresh, it's like it melts in your mouth. Okay, maybe you think what we are doing here, right? But actually the people, they make a wish in front of Gegard Monastery and then if you throw the stone on top and it remains there, your wish will come true. Okay, Let let's try. throw all the rocks, baby. Let's go. <laughs> we need a three-point shot here. <laughs> I didn't practice my basketball skills for long, but I still have the touch, guys. Let's go. Wish, baby. Oh, again, I did it again. It's second time, <coughs> one, one shot. Right. Okay, I'm getting good percentage here. Oh, I missed the layup this time. Hey guys, today we're here in the Cape Monastery. Okay, it's one of the UNESCO's heritage site. And now it's also called, called as Kegard. And this church is half built and half carved in the fourth century. Okay guys, it's time to go inside and let's check it out. Gyagard is a medieval monastery. It is listed as a UNESCO World Heritage Site. And Gyagard Monastery is an architectural wonder. It is partly carved out of a mountain. The main cathedral was built in 1215. Gyagard Monastery is located 30 kilometers from Yerevan and only 11 kilometers from Temple of Garni. And if you are planning to visit Armenia, Gyagard must be on your bucket list. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed the video. Please stay tuned as in the next episode we visit Takadzor, Seven Lake and beautiful Dilijan. And also try their most amazing food. And always remember, life is a beautiful ride. So explore, meet and eat. It's so good, uh, 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 it's alright. <laughs>